Hey YouTube, quick video on this uh, issue with, uh, with this keyboard on A1707, 2016-2017 MacBook Pro. As you can see, a couple letters are, are typing fine. And this one is like, it does not register the touch all the time. So you have to press, press it a little bit harder so not every time as you can see so the easiest way to repair this would be as follows let me see if i can get this out pry it from the top Okay. Sometimes you can get get away with just uh, just cleaning all around. We're gonna use some. I don't think it's gonna work in this case, but let me just double check. Let me try and press on this. Actually, yeah, this one actually does not need to be taken apart, the actual mechanism. But might might as well, since I already opened it up, I might as well take it, take it apart and show you. So I'm not 100%. Hundred percent sure. The easiest way I found is to peel off this little plastic tab right here. Plastic cover, okay. Don't pull it, pull it all the way, just like I did. You don't have to pull it all the way. Just a little bit to expose this metal metal contact. Well, you know what? Let me remove it since I already got it off. So basically the easiest way I found it without taking it apart is just pushing it and move it around like that. So this will actually, this is you doing metal to metal contacts and you kind of move it around so it cleans the contacts on its own. Okay. Make sure you push it and then just move it around this side and this side because there, there are there are five contacts basically or six to be uh, to be precise there's four on each leg there's an, one here on this tip and there, there are contact right here on these two indentations so just push it like that and move it around to clean it so you don't really have to take it apart unless there was liquid damage there, but there is no liquid damage on this one. So this is just uh, some, uh, it's not a corrosion, but there is some uh, residue on, it, on the actual metal contacts that's stopping it from working properly. And also what I do sometimes too, is just to move this contact a little bit, kinda give it a little sharper edge. Okay, so let me cover this for now. Just I'm gonna I'm gonna fix it later. I'm just gonna try to do it on camera right now and see if it took effect. It's definitely better.
so that's how you clean those contacts without even taking them apart so I'm, I'm holding this camera in one hand so i'm gonna fix it up here put it back together let me see if we can actually do it with one hand Let me just try and see if it's gonna if it's gonna work. Okay, clean up. And this button looks fine. Okay. Let me put it back together. I'm gonna put it aside. I'm gonna just a little funny sound. I have to fix that. I have to take it apart and put that that plastic back in properly but this is so this is the same effort i'm applying on zero as of nine and it did not work before now it's working fine just that funny sound i'm gonna fix that reapplying that plastic film okay thanks for watching